Looking forward to that. But speaking of food, it's time to check out our national day calendar. Marlo Anderson tells us what to celebrate on February 1st. Welcome to February 1st on the National Day Calendar. In 1867, there was a hot debate over the purchase of Alaska from Russia for a cool $7 million. When Secretary of State William Seward agreed to the price and Alaska became the United States Territory, some referred to it as Seward's Folly. That's when Chef Charles Ranhofer of Delmonico's Restaurant in New York City whipped up a dessert to capitalize on the heated controversy. His frozen hard ice cream on a base of sponge cake covered in toasted meringue was called Alaska, Florida for its drastic temperature contrast. It also came at a whopping price that would equal about $40 today. This strategy worked, and this dessert is still on Demonico's menu. On National Baked Alaska Day, we enjoy a sweet bite of Seward's success. I'm Marlo Anderson with the National Day Calendar. See you again tomorrow as we celebrate every day. Well, not what I was thinking. I thought that was going to be salmon. We both thought it was fish. <laughs> we're like, oh, wow, a dessert. That looks delicious. But speaking of National Day Calendar, we're going to talk with Marlo Anderson now, the founder of the National Day Calendar. Thank you so much for being here, Marlo. Well, good morning, Caitlin and Amber. We love it when Marlo is here. It's so I fun know. to have you live in here, too. So February, it's the start to a new month. Um, the month of love, if you yes. can see our heart here. So what are some notable days that we should kind of like look forward to? Because whenever we celebrate something, we like to look ahead so we can plan for it, you yeah, know, absolutely. at work. Um, so what are some days that you kind of pulled out that we should make sure to pay attention to? Well, you did mention the month of love. It is National Heart Month, by the way. So uh, take advantage of that. You know, get out and start walking this month, maybe, if you haven't started to do that. Uh, the fifth, Meteorologist Day. Oh. I know. You, oh. get, get, you have to get Tom and Amber and all yeah. these. Yeah. We get need to get her shirts a gift. or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we should. We need to get her chocolates or something. She's not here right now. Yes. So we'll think about that. We'll get her Plan a something. Shanghai set or something. But yeah. okay. And that's of course, a good one. you know, I'm picking on my favorites. So a couple of years ago, we declared the 13th of February as National Cheddar Day. Oh. And uh, I, I don't know about you guys, but I, I am addicted to cheddar cheese. Oh, so yeah, I love cheese. It's, yep. it's my go-to for snacking, unfortunately, but I do love it. Uh, the 23rd, and I love the story behind this, it is National Banana Bread Day. Ooh, yeah, and so good. Do you guys like banana bread? I love it. Yes. Yeah. I don't like nuts, though, and I'm sorry okay. that I have to be kind of picky about that. If it has nuts, I kind of feel like it ruins it. I'm sorry. That's okay. You know, people have their personal choices. I yeah. love chocolate chips in mine, by the way. Yeah. So oh, that would be good. That's a good thing, right? Uh, but actually, banana bread didn't come about until the Depression era of the 1930s uh, because people didn't want to throw away ripe bananas before that everything was done with fresh fruit. So I found that really interesting. Mm. Now that's only been around for about 80 years. It's oh. such a big thing up here in the Dakotas, I think, so. It, that's a good day to actually go in your freezer, find all those, those bananas, and, and make, make them on yes. that day. That's exactly right. That's oh, exactly mm -hmm. right. So cool. Well, um, Marlo, we have to wrap already. Oh, that's okay. that's Can fantastic. you believe it? So many days. Um, check out the calendar. I have one in my office. I look at it all the time to see what's coming up. And then you can plan ahead with your bananas or whatever. Exactly. But um, for more information, make sure you check out nationaldaycalendar.com. And stay tuned. We have our smile of the day coming up.